Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of What Is That Sound? Today we're going to look at the lead sound from Vangelis' Blade Runner theme. Hope you guys like it. First, like always, we're going to make sure we have a basic initial patch. Right now I have just a basic sawtooth. And the first step is we're going to go over to the oscillator section, make sure we have them set on sawtooth waves because that's what the sound is based off of. I'm going to bring in two oscillators for now because that sounds a little bit closer to the original for me. You can add basically as many oscillators as you want. It just beefs up the sound a little bit more and gives it a more chorus effect, which can sound kind of cool. So now it sounds like this. And as just an example, let me bring in the all four oscillators here. Of course, you can tune them to get them more in tune. But as you see, it's a bit of a beefier, more chorusy sound. So I'm just going to leave it for two for now. Next, we're going to go over to the filter section. For this section, I like to put the filter between 10 and 11 o'clock. I think that makes it sound closest to the actual lead sound when it's all done. For the resonance, we're going to leave all the way down at zero. And then the envelope amount, we're going to put at around 3 o'clock. I think that sounds the best. And also, we're going to keep the keyboard tracking all the way up so that the filter tracks across the entire key bed. And this is what it sounds like right now. Not much different, but what really brings it all into effect is the envelope generator section. First, we're going to look at the filter envelope. I like to put the attack a bit lower than 9 o'clock. So, so not quite 25%. If you do it 25% or any higher, I feel like it's a bit too long of an attack for something like this. So something lower than 9 o'clock or 25% works. Next, we're going to go to the decay of the filter envelope. I like to put that at about 50% or 12 o'clock. I feel it gives it a good delay back. Again, you can adjust it higher or lower based on what you think sounds better, but this is where I like to put it. And for the sustain, we're going to put that a little bit lower than halfway. Slightly lower, slightly to the left of 12 o'clock, for those who have knobs. And then we're not going to touch the release on this one. And this is what it sounds like now. Just going to adjust the decay a little bit. And then next, we're going to go over to the amplitude envelope generator. Now this is basically going to be exactly the same as the filter with the basic attack, except we're going to keep the sustain all the way up and the decay all the way down. And this is how it sounds now. Again, you can adjust all these parameters the way you like it, but this is what I think sounds the best. Now, we're going to add a little bit of stereo delay to it, add a little bit of backing strings and stuff. Uh, let me know what you guys think. Thanks.
Hope you guys liked this episode of What Is That Sound, and I'll see you in the next one. See ya. Like and subscribe.